10 p.m. East Coast time tonight. We're all dressed up, we're ready to go, but let's all celebrate because we also have our last look at the most amazing cast iron. Cast iron, but not old school, it's the new school. It's our last look of our best buy ever, and it all starts right here, right now. Let's go. roasting meats, we're simmering stews, we're making casseroles. Look at that. Folks, this is cast iron like we know, like we love, but this is cast iron without the seasoning, without the babying. This is cast iron that you could put in the dishwasher. It's cast iron that gives you all the upside and no downside. Oh boy, Kitchen HQ. This is exclusive. Um, every single piece that we've ever done is a customer pick. Five star rated customer pick. Today, we're launching the new and improved and upgraded four and a half quart, bigger capacity. This is that amazing brazier. But let me tell you, when we say this is nonstick, we mean it. When we say this is easy, clean, we mean it. Normally, when we say the words cast iron, you would never say, well, you'd never say clean. You'd never say nonstick. We are going to do it tonight. Um, I, I said we have the last presentation, 27,000 are sold. I have a couple thousand left, that is all. A few of the colors are gone. I'm so thankful I even have four colors. Starting with the teal, you're gonna get the heat tempered glass lid as well. Notice the silicon handle covers that you're gonna get. This is a new design with the helper handles at the side that we're gonna talk about. That's teal. This is gonna be the red right next to it, which is always the most popular. There's that gorgeous, crisp, clean white behind and then this is the one that our director Dixon bought this is the black one he's got everything black in the kitchen HQ line listen we're doing three flex pay and we're doing this with a gentleman that studied at the French Culinary Institute he is an author he is a restaurateur <laughs> he's an all-round amazing guy chef <laughs> Shahir how are you how my you friend doing? so good, good to, to be see with you. you you've been cooking up a storm and you know what it smells good it mm. still smells good in mm. here Adam this is it look at this steak this is, to me, quintessential cast iron cooking because yeah. it's all about getting hot, staying hot, getting, look at this even sear divine. of a steak, of a pork chop, of a chicken thigh that mm. looks absolutely perfect. So we always knew that cast iron is the best for searing, roasting, braising, frying for this reason. It gets hot and it stays hot, but it's always been a pain to take care of. Old school cast iron, you've got to season it. Yep. You can't really wash it. You've got to have a, a thin layer of oil. Yep. It's kind of grimy. At Kitchen HQ, we said, let's go with cast iron, make it nonstick. This is generational. This is it's something amazing. you're gonna have right forever, and you're gonna pass this down. The quality is extraordinary. And Chef, let's face it, Look the at that. price is insane. For the amount of things you'll use this for, this is your go-to pan. In this presentation, we're gonna sear, poach, braise, we're gonna fry, mm. you're gonna bake. I'm gonna show you all of that. But first, look at this. Can you do that in old school cast iron? And I'm watching you do this live. There's no magic trick There's here. no magic. We just sear those beautiful ribeyes. I just wiped it out. It's good as new. Now watch this. As I add liquid to my pan, mm. you're gonna hear it sizzle right away. This is the heat retention that I'm talking about, yep. right? I took it off the heat for a minute or two. It's still bubbling and boiling away and it's coming up to temp. Even something sticky, like a little teriyaki sauce. You wouldn't. Is not gonna to stick to the bottom. So in the presentation, we're gonna see cheese, we're gonna see sugars, we're gonna see, you know, berry crumbles. Nothing will stick. You can use your metal utensils. You would never do that in a million years, really? That's the non-stick coating protecting it. So by all means, go nuts. Now we've also got the lid, so mm. check this out. Now you're adding your veg into this teriyaki kind of sauce that I'm gonna pour onto my ribeye. And then we're gonna take some onions, we've got that teriyaki sauce, a little bit of stock, and we're gonna use this airtight lid. Now what that does is, look, right away, it traps in that steam. Mm. So now we're cooking with steam. We can poach, we can braise. It's airtight because of that silicone rim that's locking in the air, which is super important. Don't you think this is the best we've ever done? This is unbelievable to me. Like, honestly, and even the new design, there's no yep. long handle on this one. No long handle on this one because this is four and a half quarts, three inches deep. So when you see some of the big pot roasts that I'm gonna reveal later, mm. it can get to be, you know, a big crowd-pleasing thing. Yeah. So we wanted to make it super easy to handle, and with the silicone handles as well, so you don't burn your hands, you can go oven to table, stove top to table, I mean, which is awesome. This is the time of year as we get into, yep. you know, this season with Thanksgiving, with friends, with family, the holidays, we're celebrating, we're cooking, we're staying indoors. 
This is what you're going to make everything with. Um, I am being told by our lovely producer, Angela, we are already off to a flying start. I want to stress, we are scarily close to that 30,000 mark. Yep. We are 26,000 now. So final few thousand to go around. If you would like to get yours, it's there for you in red, teal, white, or the black. We'll send it to you. You've got 30 days to try it out, to experience it. What I love most of yep. all about this Kitchen HQ line, first of all, is that, Chef, you live and breathe this, right? I love this line because they gave me free reign. Right. So I got to develop recipes, take photos, really do whatever I felt like doing in my own kitchen. I have the red one at home. It lives on my stovetop. And for the last two months, I've been just cooking, playing, doing recipes. All those recipes are on hsn.com, yeah. including that ribeye with the teriyaki sauce and a focaccia bread and cobblers. And I really developed recipes that showed you can steam, sear, braise, roast, fry, yeah. bake. Yeah. You can yeah. do all of that with great cast iron. Do more with less, right? So you're Absolutely. not, it, it's so important, so important because now this makes life easier in the kitchen. So it, it takes a second to kind of get your head around it because all the things that you think about cast iron, the negative things I should clarify are not true with this. Mm -hmm. I can put this in the dishwasher. Yep. It is non-stick. Chef is gonna prove that time and time and time and time and time again. Yep. This is easy, easy clean, easy release, quick release. This is cast iron with even heat distribution, truly giving you the best cooking experience, which, I mean, ultimately, Chef, is why it's always classified as the gold standard. You ask anybody. It's, everybody says cast iron is the best. Sometimes it will even put it, Adam, on a menu. We'll say cast iron fried or right. cast iron braised because even a general diner knows that means it's gonna be good. It's right. gonna be even colored, whether it's a sear, a bake, a braise, a fry, whatever. So it's always been known, cast iron is superior. But for a lot of home cooks, they say, well, I don't wanna baby it. I don't know how to season it. What does that mean, seasoning, all that good stuff. Now, sometimes, Adam, you'll see cast irons that say, well, it's enamel coated. And those look great right out of the box, yeah. but they're not nonstick. Right. So after a couple uses, that beautiful enamel coating looks brown, kinda of looks used, right? So this coating, it is proper cast iron and it is proper nonstick. You saw me wipe out that teriyaki, but also that nonstick coating allows me to do things you can't do with old school cast iron. I cooked here with the chicken, with wine and a tomato. These are acidic ingredients. Old school cast iron, you can't do that. Sun-dried tomatoes and these eggs and cream and parm and black pepper. I'm now gonna use the lid, Adam, yeah. that airtight seal. That's poaching my eggs now. It's, so cooking for a crowd, easy. It's insane. I, folks, there's a couple things just to let everyone know in this hour, because it is chef's final hour of the day, we're doing like a buy one gift one on an ice cream maker at the end of the hour. That's awesome. It's a 10 minute yeah. deal and it's like a giveaway price. So stay with us for a big finale. We have now crossed 27,000. Again, we are now 3,000 away from that 30,000 mark. As we get closer to the 30,000, we're gonna get busier and busier and busier as more and more people say, I need to get that. This is our last cookware today, special of the year. Yep. There are no more at all. So if you wanted to get something that makes more sense because of the depth, because of the capacity, whether it's just you at home or you and your other half or even a family. Chef, this size it's and awesome. the depth is versatile. So the size is amazing, four and a half quarts. I mean, you could see the deep size I've got six chicken thighs in there. Wait to see the pot roast dinner that we're gonna do. But then again, it's a non-stick coating. So look, even my sticky teriyaki, even if I wanted to use it as my non-stick pan, just yeah. to do a couple eggs in the morning, yeah. or some pancakes, easy as pie. But then if I wanna do something to feed a crowd, poach nine eggs at the same time in some cream or tomato sauce, you can do that too. So it kind of becomes whatever you need it to be. It's a day-to-day, -day, or it can be that special occasion pan as well. So that was the same pan, yeah. Adam, that I did yeah. the steak sear in, yeah. and then we put the stock, then we put the teriyaki sauce, again, all these recipes are up, and look, this is after it's been seared, after it's been, you You're know, not scared. coated in sticky teriyaki sauce. <laughs> it's like clean. it's totally unbelievable, <laughs> right? It just look comes right up, there's nothing there, there's nothing there's left. There's nothing left. There's nothing sticking <laughs> to it. Um, so I hope that proves what many people thought would be impossible. Truly a breakthrough. This is next generation cast iron. Yep. It's real, real, real cast iron, but it's done in a way that means that there is no hassle, there is no seasoning, there is no babying, there's no maintaining it. You can dishwash this, you can be rest assured that it is easy cleanup and easy release. We have over 500 people placing orders. Did you, Angela, you say black's gonna be the first to go now? 
Okay, if you're looking for the black, final few hundred in the black. I have black, I have teal, I have red, and I have white. White is also very popular. Chef, what's coming I out of the I love the white. Oven? So check this out. Now, I talked about the big pot roast. Yes. We've seared, we braised, we're now poaching eggs. We can also roast. Now check this out. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Come on. Now this is a three pound pot roast. Wow. Okay, maybe actually a little bit more. You've got the potatoes that are just tender, right? Taking on that stock, the vegetables, and look. Oh, now you are gonna let me have some of this, you right? You can have all three pounds. Don't tempt well, me, chef. I'll do it. Save me one. Don't challenge me, I'll eat it all. I mean, are you kidding me? So in this recipe, by the way, this is an economical cut. You can get those cheaper cuts. You can get pork shoulders, really cheaper cuts, yep. and make them tender and beautiful with cast iron. Sear them, flip them, yep. stock, veg. Now you get the airtight lid, finish it in the oven or stovetop, and you've got the perfect result. I mean, it's magic. It really is. It's the best way to cook. It's the best way to make the most of what you're doing in the kitchen, whether it's making something simple, quick, and easy for you and your husband on an evening, or for the entire family if you're doing a Sunday lunch. This is exactly what we need. We're really busy now, folks. We are about to hit 27,400. Again, every one that is sold gets us closer to that 30,000 mark, and then it's really all but done and dusted. If you would like to grab it, we're doing FlexPay, so the FlexPay brings it home for $11 and change. We'll ship it to you. You've got 30 days to experience it. Cook with it, use it, explore the opportunities with it. If you don't think it's amazing, send it back for a refund of the purchase price, but do not miss out. The price also, is expiring, I should say. I don't think there's gonna be any left, so it's kind of a non-issue. But sometimes with our today's specials, there's what's called a post-sale. There is no post-sale with this. The price will go up uh, in two and a half hours. So there's the black, which we are selling out of very quickly. If you want the black, call now. This is the white, which is blazing a trail in this presentation. There is the red. I need not even sell the red because everybody wants the red. Everybody loves the red. This one is gonna be Ooh. your teal. So we have the teal available as well. It's nice to bring some character and personality into the kitchen, Chef, don't you For think, sure. having these colors? And you know, the whole brand does really great with colors. At Kitchen HQ, whatever, if you go on hsn.com and peruse through whatever we have, mm. we really take pride in the colors. I know a lot of people like to have a theme of colors in their kitchen. Yeah. So if you look at our whole lineup, you can pick red, you could pick those vibrant blues, black and white, obviously. So many different colors to pick from and stick to a theme if you like. Mm. Isn't that great? And it's so simple. Like oh, I chef. said, you don't have to go for the expensive tenderloin. This is a, a simple pot roast, and that's the four and a half quart quantity. The three inch height makes it perfect for roasting a pot mm. roast or a turkey breast or a chicken or, you know, these whole one pan roast dinners are amazing. And look, mm. cast iron stays hot. This is still steaming. My poached eggs that I did earlier, yes. a little bit of cream, yes. some black pepper, some sun-dried tomatoes, which I love because it kind of infuses that little rose color some Parmesan cheese. This is an elegant way to do a brunch dish at home without poaching individual eggs mm. in a stainless steel pot that loses its heat. It's this perfect. melts in your mouth, I gotta tell you. It's just so delicious. I think it's exciting because there's so, what I've seen is so much confusion when it comes to kitchen cookware. Yep. There's lots of fancy names and fancy brands and fancy materials and fancy patterns and, 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 and lots of gobbledygook as it were. We know cast iron, <laughs> right? We know what cast iron is and why it's so good. Grandma had cast iron, mom has yep. cast iron. We know cast iron is that gold standard. But if you can take traditional cast iron and upgrade it, give it the twist, a modern day twist, then you're onto a winner. Because all the things that we loved about cast iron are right here. Better cooking, even cooking, just better all round. Yep. But eliminate the heartache. I can dishwash this. I don't have to worry about things sticking. Uh, I have a cast iron pan that's gonna to continue to look as good as new without having to uh, maintain it. I don't have to season it. I, I can use this as I would a normal pan, but get the better results every single time. All right, we're nearly at 28,000. So again, I, I've been yabbering on for a little bit. I've been talking gobbledygook, another three, 400. <laughs> I've just been, don't agree with that deep on cameras. I see you over there. He says, I've talked a lot of gobbledygook, you're naughty. Okay. <laughs> This is truly and honestly an amazing buy. Chef, let's talk to that. You must have used so many different products in your life, right? And tons of cast iron over my life. I've always loved cast iron. Years ago when I wrote my cookbook, Adam, about four years ago, yes. I wrote in the book, 
everyone should have a cast iron pan. Did you really? I, it's in my own writings about four years ago, and I truly believe that. At the time, I didn't know there was such a thing right. as non-stick cast iron right. pans, because right. I would have been all over that. Right. I don't think it existed at the time. Right. So the idea that you could take the essence of a cast iron mm. and make it easy, easy to take care of, non-stick. I mean, we've seen me wipe out the same pan after searing a steak. Mm. We've seen me use the same pan after having a sticky teriyaki sauce. Let me show you the bottom of this pan. This recipe mm. is on hsn.com, one of those recipes I talked about that I developed with pictures. It's a sticky cobbler, very easy. But look, let me get to the bottom. All that fruity goodness, yep. not sticking. Nope. Metal utensils, don't worry about it. Yep. And look, all that sugary stuff. It's gonna be harder for me to clean the spoon than the pan. <laughs> and look, you can see the bottom of the pan easy. And Adam, I've been saying it all day. Mm. When you're worried about the cleanup, you don't reach for the pan. When you dread the cleanup, you say, ah, and you don't end up using it. This is cast iron you can use every day. You can wipe it out after hard searing a steak and it will be clean. A little hot water, a little soapy water, even put in the dishwasher, it's gonna be clean. Isn't that the truth though? When, when we buy something, if we find it to be difficult or yep. hard or awkward, <laughs> We don't reach for it. it just, it's like an appliance that you buy that is ugh, too many pieces, too yep. many things. You, it's there, it just lives in the cupboard, you never use it. With this, you'll always reach for it, it will always be your go-to. Black is nearly gone. Angela, which was the second most Look limited now? After the black, it's teal. All right, black and teal, last call, folks. Black and teal, last call. I also want you to think about, if I may be so bold, um, holiday gifts, uh, hostess gifts, I mean, again, $34 and change, it's a really, really low price, big quality. And again, you, you feel that quality when you hold it. One of the brilliant things about this is, versus last year's model, they put the two helper handles, as I love to call them, on the side. So now it's easier to transport from stove to table. And let me tell you, the mm -hmm. two silicon covers, you're getting those, they're color coded with whichever you choose. We normally sell silicone covers like this. I don't know, prices vary, but five, 10, $15, we're including it. So now you're never gonna burn your fingers, never burn your hands. It's like, just, just like Chef is doing, right? Talk about stove to table, oven to table. And I really wanna emphasize the sheer capacity. This is a four and a half oh quart pasta gosh. bake that got really beautiful. <laughs> I popped it under the broiler to get oh. some beautiful color. But I just wanna show you, you can get into this Non-stick, and I mean it, we've seen sugar, now we're gonna see ooey gooey cheese. And look at the sheer quantity, right? Now, it gets hot and stays hot. That means if I put this enormous pasta bake on my table, mm. I just wanna show you the bottom. It's gonna stay hot for like 45 minutes. Because like of the cast iron. Because the cast iron's retained heat. Guys, can you get the shot of the bottom? I mean, look how much pot this is. <laughs> if anybody I'm can gonna get feed the 20 shot, people. Deke is gonna get the shot, Deke, I know he will. Come get on, down Deke. below, look. There's my cheese, there's my sauce. I've reached the bottom. So imagine, once I get to the bottom of that big pasta bake, mm. even that cleanup will be easy. But sheer quantity, and I think it looks great. The fact that you add in those silicone handles yeah. means you go oven or stove to table, and it also means your guests, if they're serving themselves, won't burn their hands, they right. won't burn right. their fingers, so it's great. It's a thoughtful extra, and again, yeah. I, just to stress, a lot of times people worry with cast iron about weight. So if you have a traditional cast iron pan with a long handle at the side, Obviously, when you go to pick that up, there's a lot of weight that's gonna be on your wrist, right? That's not always comfortable. This is much better because you're distributing the weight in the pan itself and you're using both hands to transport it from the stovetop or from the oven to the table. So it makes a lot of sense. I think you'll love that as well. Yeah. It's big enough for the whole family. It's small enough to use every day without it being cumbersome. And it's just an all-round bestseller. Chef is not back this year with another Cookware Today special. This is the last one of 2023. And Chef, yeah. I know you read so many of the reviews. I don't think I've ever seen another cookware line where virtually everyone is five star. I think people recognize how special this is. And you're right. People want cast iron. They know it's good. They know it's the way to do it but they never want to take care of it, right? Yes. They never knew, what does it mean to season it? Yes. Like, what does that mean? Yeah. What do you mean I can't clean it after cooking chicken? Like, I wanna clean it. <laughs> Make it non-stick, and that's what we did. You still have the virtues of cast iron. You still there have it the is. quality of cast iron, right? But you get it non-stick. You're doing your smash burgers. You're searing and braising your chicken. Even from frozen shrimp, we're gonna do a quick scampi. From the oven, you're doing your pot roast, your chicken roast, a giant pasta bake, and as you head into holiday season, 
Think about those dishes where you want to entertain a crowd, you can do it. Look at those mussels. Gorgeous. They steamed in real time in about five, six minutes. Put it right on the table like so. Yeah, like, yeah, I think yeah. it looks great. It does look great, and I can't be the only one. Chef and I can't be the only ones in America who see this price and just go, what on earth? Yeah. $34.99? Even Andrew, who's on the studio floor, he looks bewildered, <laughs> bewildered at this. He's throwing his hands in the air. It's an insane deal, and that's why we've sold 28 and a half thousand. Okay, we started, we're at 26. I said to everybody we were gonna get close to the 30,000, and we are nearly there as we get over 29,000. We're gonna get even busier, and then it is last call across the board. I have 200 left if you're looking for black, um, about three, 5400 if you're looking for teal. I have red available and I have the white available as well. Oh. Maybe you want to get one as a housewarming gift, one for your sister for Christmas, one for you. I mean, really, at this price point, to be delivered to your door on a flex payment of uh, $11 and change is so worthwhile. Remember, Chef and I have a, a really good hour. On the way next, we're going to sell out the world's best automated can opener. At the end of this hour, we have an ice cream maker, it's a two pack, it's like a giveaway. You will not believe the price of the ice cream makers that are coming up, so stick around for that. It's in about 25 minutes, I promise you, you will be stunned. Um, all right, let's go back over to Chef. Chef, Check what are we doing out. now? The ultimate, for me, smash burgers. Mm. Look at the crust. This is what you want with a smash burger because you're getting that ultimate surface area. The beef is touching all of the cast iron. If I did this in steel or yeah. aluminum, what happens is you get little spotty dark bits and gray bits. It's not perfectly crusty. And then cheese right on. Oh, now, yeah, Adam, man. if this cheese cascades down over my burger, yeah. I don't worry about it. Right. I want that. Right. And I know it's not going to be a pain to clean no up mess. after. I'm doing it in real time. No mess. I mean, stick even for cheese. One of the things we love about cooking with Shahir is that, you know, you get to see everything in real time yep. as it happens live. Um, so the results are guaranteed. This is some pre-recorded, edited out of the bad bits. You're seeing everything happen. Yep. And Chef has proved it. He's demolished these dishes to <laughs> prove to you that there is no stick, there is no hassle. And that's why it doesn't just meet the expectations that you've got. Um, it exceeds them. It, it, it smashes them. It truly does. All right, with that being said, we're getting busier. Now 600 and something people on the phone line. Red is nearly gone, sorry, teal is nearly gone. Black is nearly gone. White is really blazing a trail. And don't forget the red. If you don't know what color to buy, buy the red. Everybody loves the red. You'll instantly identify it and you'll love it. Remember, you've got the KHQ, Kitchen HQ logo on the top. This is that heat tempered glass lid with the steam release valve that's there. And you get the silicon handle covers to go with it. Chef, this is, a, this is awesome. a, a new model, as it were, for the new year. That's right. So last year we had the, you know, a, a bit of a smaller model with a handle. And then we listened to you and they said, look, it's a little bit cumbersome. We want to be able to take this from oven or from stovetop yeah. to table. Great. So we took out that long, cumbersome handle and put in two shorter ones so that you could easily do that with the silicone handle yes. protectors. So this is the great thing about being the in-house brand. We can actually pivot and make things happen. We listen to you and we want you to have functional cookware that you're actually gonna have fun using day to day. I wanna encourage you to find and follow Chef Shahir. He's an amazing talent. If you go to HSN, I'm talking about you like you're not here, Look Chef. At that. <laughs> Um, if you go to hsn.com and click on the Today's Special, you'll actually see a little picture of Chef, and if you click on that, you'll get access to some of the recipes yep. of some of the featured dishes that Chef has been uh, uh, cooking all day long, so I encourage you. In fact, uh, our lovely producer, Angela, just found it right there, that little picture of Chef. You click on it, and that gives you access to some really tempting, tempting recipes that you can try right out of the gate with your new cast iron. And that's the thing, Chef, once yeah. you try this, I think you'll be addicted to it because it is so easy and fun. And I think you're gonna see that, unlike old school cast iron where you're worried to use it, you don't know how to take care of it, what does it mean to season it? This is like using a non-stick pan, right? right? Right. And you use it as such, but then you get the benefits of cast iron. You're gonna be searing, you're gonna be poaching, you're gonna be roasting, you're gonna be braising, you're gonna be frying because you get that even heat. So whether you're frying fried chicken or donuts mm. or whatever you're frying, this I've been doing all day and people have been loving this because they can resonate with it. Look, when you put something, and this is cold donut dough, into your hot oil, you see that the bubbles are now rolling and you get small, even yeah. bubbles. That to me means your heat is still there, it hasn't dropped. 
When you deep fry, and this is why grandma, you know, used to fry chicken in cast iron, it stays hot. If your oil temperature drops, that's when things get greasy because the food sucks up the oil. Right. That's what you don't want. So you want to be able to put food into your oil, even cold food, and see those little bubbles working magically. That means your oil temperature is still constant. So cast iron, when we say it over and over again, gets hot, stays hot. I do mean it for all these elements of, se of searing, braising, roasting, poaching, baking, when you do your cornbread and cast iron you're gonna get even color because you get even heat. So all those different cooking aspects, you get even heat and that's what you want. Now look at the even color on my donuts. Oh my gosh. So when you're cooking at home, and I know this happens a lot to home cooks, whether you're frying or searing or braising, roasting, sometimes you say, I'm not getting even color and I don't know why. It's because you're not getting even heat. So professional chefs have long loved cast iron for that equal, even heat distribution, whatever the cooking process is. And that's what we're seeing here today with all these recipes, and that's what you want to do at home with those recipes on hsn.com. Isn't it tempting, though? It's so, so tempting to try it because everything's <laughs> right about it. Yeah. I mean, the food looks amazing, obviously. Uh, the benefits are clearly there. It's cast iron, so that already rings yep. some bells. It's like, oh, cast iron. I've always wanted a cast iron pan. You're telling me I don't need to season this? I can yeah. dishwash this? I, I can use this and not be fearful that it's going to be a pain in the neck, <laughs> but I get all the benefits of cast iron. Yeah, you do. You it's really do. I mean, Chef, let's say it as it is. Since Kitchen HQ launched their cast iron line, yep. it has been a, our fastest selling new kitchenware ever. And, and, and it's simple. It's because it's about a simple solution. Yeah. That's really what we do as a brand. We come up with simple solutions to everyday problems for the home cook. And we actually work backwards at them. So we work backwards and say, okay, chef, what do you love to cook with? And I say cast iron. Right. And then we think about you and say, well, what does the average home cook love? Yeah. Well, they love easy cleanup. They love, you know, nonstick. Yeah. And then we kind of put the two together yeah. and we've done it successfully here. We had a great run last year with this similar size, yes. and I think it gets better and better with your input, so thank you for that. So, Chef, I'm gonna switch sides with sure. you for a second. Folks, come over here if you, if you wouldn't mind. I, I wish we had two hours. I feel like we're rushing <laughs> along here. We're, so we're gonna sell out the can opener next. There's like 900 of those, and then we're gonna do a mandolin slicer really fast, and then we've got this buy one, gift one, buy one, kind of get one. Ice, you get two ice cream makers for a giveaway price. We are now over the 29,000 threshold. We are now officially in sellout quantities. So we're taking our final orders as we speak. I don't have any advanced order, extended delivery. This is the last of it. Final 150 if you're looking for black. Final 200 or so if you're looking for teal. Red is most available, I'm being told, uh, but is the best seller. <laughs> so it's, you know, it kind of cancels each other out. Red is selling the fastest. Uh, we have the white. White's a beautiful choice as well because the white, as it contrasts with the cast iron black on the inside, looks amazing. You will get the heat-tempered glass lid. Uh, and obviously, as we've been mentioning, you get the silicon covers. We have done many, many, many a time cooking shows where you buy these as an extra. $5, $10, $15. We will include them with every order that is placed before we sell this out. So every order will include the silicon covers to go on the handles. And that just means that you're not going to burn your hands and it's easy to transport it from the stove, from the oven to the tabletop. So we love that. Notice how I'm holding this. I'm using both hands. So I don't have a pan, any pan, let alone a cast iron pan, with one long handle where I lift it up and there's so much weight on my hand and my wrist. And that can be really painful. It can be, ah, uh, this is nice and easy. Okay. In a few moments, we will be removing the black and the teal from the studio. That is last, 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 last chance as we hit 29,300. This is gonna be an interesting race, the clock or a sellout. Three flex pay, $11 and change. Chef, okay. there's a lot of us that have spent hundreds of dollars on cookware and not yep. been happy. And you're not happy because you don't use it. If you know it's gonna be a pain to use and things are gonna stick and things are gonna be hard to clean, you don't end up reaching for that cookware, right. right? So it might look nice, it might look attractive, it might sound fancy, it might even be expensive. And if you don't use it, you don't use it. Right. So we wanted to come up with a cast iron lineup that you're gonna reach for over and over again because you don't fear using it. I think we've shown really great how non-stick it is from the searing of the steak, wiping it clean, to the bottom of a cobbler pan where it's super sticky but not sticking to the bottom yes, of our pan, yes. right? Even salmon fillets, right? 
Nothing is sticking. No, nope, And this is the around. stuff that people are worried about. Oh my gosh, will it stick? Skin on chicken, never stuck. We, you know, we seared it. Now we're braising it. Little shrimps. Whatever you're doing, it's gonna be easy to use, but you're getting the benefits of the even heat distribution of cast iron. It's gotta be worth the try, right? Because if you love it, it changes everything. If you give it a chance, you've got 30 days. If you don't love it, send it back for a refund of the purchase price, but you should try it. This isn't the first. We've done many yeah. different cast iron. I mean, I told you I direct to Dixon. I think he's got the entire collection at this stage. But the one thing that he has said, that we have said, that you have said in our reviews, is that it delivers and people love it. And yeah. I think we also appreciate the price point. $34.99. For all of these benefits, you might imagine it would be more. In fact, the retail price is $87, which even that sounds really a good value for what it is and the size, the four and a half, uh, half quart capacity. But to go from $87 to $34.99 is just a massive discount. If there is even one left at midnight, the price will go back up. So bear that in mind as you do it. Chef, just a couple minutes remain, yeah. and those salmon's looking gorgeous the already. The salmon's are working, and like I said earlier, you don't have to worry about cooking with acidity like lemon or wine or tomato. Old school cast iron, you can never do this. With this, you can. Nothing is sticking, and acid is your friend, mm. okay? You can now build a little pan sauce in with the salmon. So, so far, we've done the seared chicken. We've seared and we've braised. We've done the teriyaki steak. We've done the smash burgers. We've poached eggs and cream and parm and mm. sun-dried tomato. We made a quick shrimp scampi from frozen shrimp, and it's got hot right away. Yeah. We've done the cobblers. We've done two big quantity to show off that four and a half quart capacity of the shreddable pot roast, imagine yeah. a pork shoulder, yeah. or this huge, sticky cheese bake, pasta bake, that won't stick to the bottom. Guys, if you see, by the way, still steam coming out of this. Yeah, this yeah, there been, is. Look at the steam. So it's still red hot. This has been out of the oven for like 20 minutes, right? We did the mussels, we used that lid, the sealable lid allowed us to steam those mussels in wine and garlic and stock. And then over here, we fried. Yeah, and we did. as we fried, the temperature stayed constant. It didn't drop. That's what you want from cast iron, and yet it's non-stick. I, I, I just love for you to get one. I think you'll, oh, wait a minute. I was just about to take a bite of my donut. Hold <laughs> on, let me put it back down. Still hot, still <laughs> hot. Guys, we are gonna call the black now sold out, so I'll move it over to this side of the studio. If it's in your shopping cart, check it out as fast as you can. Teal will be the next to go. Red will be the next to go. Uh, if there's any left, it looks like there'll be some of the white. Red is the best seller. Red is the best seller at this stage. Um, congratulations, I hope you love this. You just got our last cookware today, special of the year, at the lowest price, cast iron with all the upgrades. Do not hang up, we are counting you in. Um, final orders have been placed right now. Let us know what you think. Chef wants to hear from you, we wanna hear from you. Um, also, we'd love for you to join the family. If you apply for an HSN credit card and you get approved, you can take $10 off your first single item purchase. So don't forget, if you, um, um, oh, the salmon. Don't save me that salmon for dinner, Adam. And Trace, will oh, you save me one so of the salmon? Save us the salmon. We want to thank Tracy, who's here thank as you, well. Tracy. Who is the best, best, best in the kitchen. And she's been at HSN. Can we just get a shot of Tracy, Tracy for a second? Tracy is the best. Come here. This lady, she let me tell you. She all day long. She has a heart of gold. She's an amazingly <laughs> talented lady. And she's been here for how many years? 26. 26! And she looks younger than ever. We love you, Tracy. <laughs> Thank you, Trace. <laughs> um, all right, we've got a quick sellout. Um, the, the can opener. The can opener! The, the can opener, the one-touch can opener, the famous one-touch can opener. I mean, it does all the talking. Look, when you talk about a can... Screaming so at that, Screaming at me, look. <laughs> when you talk about a can, you got to make sure you're full of batteries, guys. It's been a long day. Yes, yes. When you talk about a one-touch can opener, you press it once, let it go around the can. Now, check this out. As it goes around the can, this might look familiar to a lot of you. This is the old school rusty can opener. Why is it rusty? Old school can openers get inside the food. Yes. And that's what causes the rust. Yeah. At Kitchen HQ, simple solutions. We wanted a one touch can opener that goes around the food. Yes. So this will never rust. This you're never gonna fight with. These old school can openers, you kind of have to wrestle to find the yeah, edge, yeah. right? You get down yeah. and find the lip and you say, okay, it will be good this time. It's an and it never is, right? We wanted to come up with something that is so easy, you put it down, you press it once, it going around the food, it will never rust. Now, when it goes all the way around, yeah. there's actually a magnet that pulls off that lid. 
Um, look how easy that is. Did you see that, guys? And look how clean it is. Clean, smooth. It's not gonna cut your not finger. dangerous. And it's not, you know sometimes with those old school can openers, you're wrestling with a jagged edge. Yes. The magnet solved that problem. And here's another thing. When you have a clean cut here and a clean cut here, you can actually reseal the can. Oh my god! So this is the best can opener. It's gonna change the way you open cans. There is a rumor that you get the batteries included. Can you confirm or deny you this? You get the batteries included as well because you don't wanna open it up and not have batteries. Like, so you get the batteries included, press it once, let it do its thing. So folks, here's where we are. Angela, how many are left now? We have 1,000 exactly, four minutes or sell out, whichever happens first. An amazing buy. Yep. I have it in black, there's red, there's teal. What color is that, Chef? Do you remember what color that is? That's more of like our rose color. It's a rose, right? you're yeah, on yeah, the yeah. money. Yeah. It's a rose, it's a quick test. There's <laughs> the red one, there's the white one. We all need an automated can opener. It does make life easier, clearly, rather than the old style. We were just talking with my dear Boom. friend here, Andrew. Look at that. And I know you spoke about this last night. That's how HSN started with a traditional can okay, opener. Okay, so this tale has been told to me. 40 years ago, this was the first thing ever sold on HSN. It was. And I said to him last night, that's a good run. We did pretty they good. Did well, let's now move on. Upgrade. Press the button once, let the magnet take off the lid, and you don't have to wrestle. You know how sometimes you wrestle with that? Yes, yeah. yes, yes, yes. That's how you get yes. cut. That's over. You see that the magnet took off my lid for me. Yep. By the way, I also love to show this part of the demo. It doesn't matter what size can. Right. It could be as small as a tomato paste or you know a big That's can, mid-sized can. That's an important point. Small, short, big, medium, can. it doesn't it, matter. It, it doesn't matter. So use the magnet side here. Here's the magnet. Clip it to the side and literally press it once, and that's why we call it the one-touch can opener. It Easy. is a beloved item at HSN. How many left now, Angela, with the one? Red is about to sell out. Red is about to sell out. I have rose, I have white, I have teal, and I have black. Great gift idea. Anybody for the, ho I mean, we've got to stop thinking about little gifts uh, uh, for the holidays, friends, family. $16.95, lowest price ever, and it's Great. so usable and will be appreciated. Do you know somebody that has that old style can opener? This is better because it doesn't have to live on your tabletop like some of them do. It goes away in the drawer and it does That's a it. better job than most. And it, it's just so simple. Again, around the food, mm. we wanted to solve every problem that came with a standard can opener. This will not rust because it goes around the can, not into the can. This old school can opener covered in rust because it's digging into the can, yeah. thus touching the food, thus getting rusty. But then again, that magnet here that allows you to clip onto it also pulls the lid clean off so that this situation, you know the hanging kind yeah, of lid? Yeah, 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 yeah. Will never happen again. And when you get into the hanging lid territory, that's a big no-no. That's is. when you start cutting yourself. So that's the problem we solve. There's no jagged edges like so many of the yeah. can openers leave behind. And again, this is so clean and smooth and perfect. Chef is putting the lid back on it. Yeah. I mean, that's the amazing, it's not jagging and awful. Red last call, rose last call, white last call now. Those three are about to sell out. With all folks ordering, about 400, 500 left at the absolute most. This is the last presentation of our can opener for 2023. So this is the last chance to get the can opener for 2023. We don't have any more available for the rest of the year. And again, yeah. best value, best price. It's the little things, right, Chef? It's simple solutions to everyday problems in the kitchen. This is really what our whole brand is about. We really put our thinking caps on and say, okay, so how can we solve just an everyday problem for a home cook. Mm. This can opener was so simple and yet people mm. love it because so many people are out there fighting with an old can opener, cutting themselves and fighting with the jagged edge. It's a simple solution to a simple problem and we love it. Red just sold out. Thank you for it's all great. your orders on red here. The colors that remain, rose gold, about a dozen left. This is the white, this is the teal, this is the black. Last opportunity to be able to get it. They are doing it on FlexPay. Great. I think the FlexPay brings it down to $5 and change. What you'll notice, though, is it's not fidgety. No. Every single time, Chef places it on, presses One the button, touch. boom, you walk away, right? And it's so cool. I love how you said, by the way, when you get that clean cut, you can reseal it. I do that a lot with tomato paste, because yeah. oftentimes I'll open a tomato paste, take a spoon, and then put the lid back sure. on. So it's perfect for that as well. Okay, Chef and I are gearing up for two mega items. Don't forget a buy one gift one, a two pack of ice cream makers at a price that will make love your head these. spin around, I promise you. So stay with us, Chef and I have got something else up our sleeve. Stay in the ordering process for this, and we'll see you right after this. Cheers to 40 years. Cheers to 40 years, Bobby. I love you. Happy 40th anniversary, Bobby. We love you. Happy anniversary 
Man, it goes by quick. Cheers to 40 years, Bobby Ray. Cheers to 40 years, Bobby. Cheers to 40 years and many more. Cheers to 40 years, Bobby. Congratulations. Here's to 40 more years. Love you. Tune in for Bobby's 40th anniversary special, September 16th from 5 to 8 p.m. The HSN deal is a great value that we bring to you every day. Thanks to our long and valued partnerships with the brands you love most, we are able to offer amazing products at great values. Shop the HSN deal with confidence from us to you. Ingredients that are rich in tradition. Born from the clouds and foothills of the Himalayan mountains. Clean beauty that protects, nourishes, and repairs hair and skin. Shop the Tweaked by Nature Beauty Collection on HSN and HSN.com. My singular goal is to improve the quality of people's lives. Everything we do is intended to be unlike any other company of our kind. We just make exceptional vitamins so you could have exceptional health. It's not important that you get the products I'm offering, but it's very important that you get the information I'm sharing because information is the key to being a healthy person. about these ice cream makers. We're yeah. gonna do them basically next in about four or five minutes. Before we do that, I do want you to see this. Mandolin slices are all the rage. Yeah. Kitchen HQ introduced their vertical mandolin with a larger shoe, bigger blades. Chef, this is different and better. This is different and better. This is another example of us listening to you. First improvement, we've increased the size of the chute. We call it our XL. Look, you could do two cucumbers at the same time. Oh my you gosh. You could do a bunch of carrots at the same time, right? Second improvement, we made the actual container larger so you can, you can catch more. The first version had a really small kind of container yeah. and food was going everywhere. But check this out too. Back here, guys, I don't know if you can get this shot. You can adjust how thin or how thick you like to slice your so cucumbers, your carrots, your I zucchini. Yeah. You just twist it like that. And you can go super thin there. It's just a dial. And you it's can just go a thicker. dial. It's just a dial. So one of the scariest things right here, guys, thin, or that's thick to thin, right? I like that rather than various pieces that you have to switch out. And you know? there it comes. Now, one of the scariest things in the kitchen is a mandolin because people are afraid to get their fingers in the way, right? This solves that problem. Check it out. So you can adjust how thin, how thick, and you could do a big batch, cucumbers for a salad, carrots, no knife, no cutting board, no scary mandolin, it's great. Now color wise, as you imagine, Kitchen HQ, we have those same matching colors to so many of the things that you might have already seen. Yeah. We have black, we have teal, we have white, we have red, we even have a gray over here. Notice the extra large, generously sized handle as it were, that's what Chef is using to press down, to push down. Yep. So you if you have arthritis or dexterity problems, you'll find this very easy to use because it's not hard work, yet you're able to get a lot done and do it quickly, so prep time is cut in half. Super easy, I mean, look at my sliced radishes. You can throw in that XL kind of shoot a bunch of different radishes, and because we have that larger container, it catches everything. So it's super great in terms of if ever you've been afraid to use a mandolin to get your fingers in the way, your fingers are not in the way because you also have this presser to keep it out of the way. Totally safe totally quick, and again, you have control over how thick or how thin. You're gonna be slicing your salamis, you're gonna be slicing your onions, yeah. your cucumbers, your carrots. It's an easy way to eat fresh and keep your fingers safe. You know, that's the thing, right? We love, I mean, being in the kitchen cooking, but, and eating, but we don't love all the prep work. Yeah. There's a lot of gadgets and gizmos out there that look to reduce time in terms of prep work. Some of them we love, some of them are a bit fidgety. This is a customer pick. So those that have bought it previously have raved about it. Today we've got it on sale at $24.95 and three flex pay. Red is popular, black is now limited. Even. Incidentally, uh, that's and another big even story, right? slices. So whenever you want to have an even slice for, look, these onions would have been great on those smash burgers, yeah. right? You don't want to get a mandolin where your fingers are in the way. And that's what our viewer has told us and we listened. So we wanted to make it bigger, better, and you can adjust how thin, how thick. You even have some teeth here if you want to do like a french fry cut yeah. or different cuts, it's totally easy. So folks, we are 60 seconds away from our big reveal of our finale item. 
a buy one gift one, buy one get one, I suppose. It's two ice cream makers at a silly, crazy, yep. amazing price. What a way to end the day. After we uh, do that and sell that out, Heidi Das will be here celebrating 20 years on HSN. I hope you join us for the big celebration. Um, okay, last call here. I think it's worth a try. It's yep. something different. You're not using traditional kitchen tools that are awkward, that can be dangerous, that don't give you the consistency. This Even delivers. Even perfect slices. And this is what you want from a traditional mandolin, except again, at Kitchen HQ, we made it better, safer, faster, and bigger so you can put more and do it at the same time. Noticeably larger, and that's a Noticeably good larger. thing. That's good. a good thing. Thank you for your orders here. Don't forget hsn.com is your best resource for all things Kitchen HQ and also all things uh, origami. Yeah, if you're looking for some fabulous ways to organize and declutter, check out all the origami products that we have by searching origami in that search bar. All right, let's bring this day to a close. Yes. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, <laughs> Not one, but two ice cream makers, which obviously screams fun. How much do you think? Did anybody guess $29.95 for two of them, individually boxed, two of them? One for you, one as a gift? It's true. So my only caveat, it's right here on my cards. Once we sell these out, these are not back at this price. I can offer you white teal. You will get both of them if you run to the phone. There's only around 500 here. This is black white. I expect that to be very popular. I expect the white red to be the most popular. A few hundred, a few hundred, and a few hundred. Why do I want an ice cream maker? <laughs> a million reasons, and we're gonna find out why. Chef, making ice cream is not so hard, right? Okay, so I wanted to do Ice Cream 101 because I'm sure a lot of people out there have said, well, I've never made ice cream. Homemade ice cream is literally Cream, sugar, and vanilla. Right. That's it. And the thing about making ice cream at home is you are in control. If you want to go half cream, half milk, you're in gelato territory. You got less fat. If you want to cut back on the sugar, you got control. If you want to use a natural sweetener, maple, honey, agave, you got that too. You want to make frozen yogurt, go for it. Sorbets, I'll show you. So you can do all of that at home. And if you buy ice cream at the store and flip around the ingredient listing and read that, carcinogens and preservatives, lots of sugar. You're, you're like, what am I doing? Scary. Make it at home and have fun with it and have control over the amount of lactose, the amount of sugar. So that's my basic ice cream base. Cream, vanilla, sugar, that's it. That's all you need. Now you pour it into your ice cream maker and all it's gonna do is churn. In about 15 to 20 minutes, you will have freshly churned ice cream or frozen yogurt or gelato or sorbet and that's all you gotta do. And Adam, I love this size because other ice cream makers, any ice cream maker on the market yep. has to be rock hard cold in your freezer for at least 24 hours. Okay. I like that size because my real estate is valuable in my freezer. Ice cream maker sometimes this big yes. is taking up the whole freezer. Yes. So you could put even one in at a time yeah. or two in at a time or gift one and keep one. I think it's the right size. Did we mention it's $29.95 Look at that. two of them? Two of them, look at this, folks. This is this, this is, is the money shot right now here. Now this, oh my gosh. That is the sorbet that I did. Oh my goodness. Okay, and I just want you to know that, mm, I'm gonna serve some up too. Yes, please. It's a straight up Ooh. strawberry sorbet. I put a little bit of lime zest in it, a little bit of lime juice, no added sugar. And the consistency is wonderful. It's like a little soft serve sorbet, no added sugar, and you're not missing anything. I mean, oh, I think it tastes so. divine. When I do this for my kids, they love it. They're just eating fruits. You know, so think about this, Adam. Now, this is something that I did at home as well. Listen to the mental math. We had a birthday party for my son. He turned six years old. Oh. And so I got four of them, and I lined them up. And all the kids at the birthday party made their own flavor and got oh, their own nice. toppings, whatever. And when I did the mental math, for me to rent out a birthday party place yes. for your kids or for grandkids, yeah. it gets so expensive these days. I'd rather have four of these on a counter, bring the kids over, let them make ice cream. Yeah. And next thing you know, they're saying, hey, it's an ice cream party, right? So it's interactive, it's fun, and making ice cream at home is about controlling your sugar, your lactose, your fat, frozen yogurt, gelato, whatever you wanna make, and I also developed recipes for this as well, so check it out. Very easy to do. Again, I want you to find mm. Chef Shahir. You can see so many mm. different recipes on hsn.com. That. that is delicious. Mm. So, so nice. I think it is exciting. It brings families together. The kids, the grandkids love this. And so will you, because it's going to be homemade ice cream. Yeah. And you'll do it in such a short amount of time. 
If you have certain dietary needs or somebody in the family has dietary restrictions, you can customize this to whichever way you want it to be. Chef, this is looking scrumptious. Now, think about this. So, imagine you're at a six-year-old's birthday party, right? Mm. And you get the toppings out, and you tell the kids or your grandkids, okay, now you can make your own flavor. Put in your own, you know, candies or chocolate syrup or caramel syrup. Now they can come up with a name for their flavor. Like, it's just one of those things that goes beyond just going to the ice cream parlor <gasps> and treating them. And then, I mean, it's just... Now, this is the chocolate version. Now, look. Now look at this, Adam. Oh, chef. I threw in those M&Ms. This is the same vanilla base. All you do is put cocoa powder, you got chocolate ice cream. If you put green tea powder, you got matcha ice cream. If you put maple in there, you got maple ice cream, right? So you can get creative with, mm, whatever flavor you want. Mm. That's delicious. Using this simple base of vanilla, cream, and sugar. But again, it's about control. You can go half cream, half milk, you got gelato. You can go frozen yogurt, you can go sorbet. Different milks as well, I presume, right? You can use lactose-free milks. Let's say you're watching your lactose. Absolutely. Okay, folks, they're telling me we are extremely busy. Mm. So I'm going to give you a quick update on colors over here, and then after we've had our Look ice cream party, that one's for me, chef. You got it. Um, we're going to be celebrating 20 years of the incomparable Heidi Das here on HSN. It really is real. You will get two ice cream makers for $29.95 if you order it right now. We have exceeded 1,000. We are nearly sold out in two of the colors. This is white teal. In the system, you'll order white teal. This is black white, black white, easy. This is actually leading the way right now. And then we have our white red as well. So white red is available. Giftable, giftable, giftable. Who could you gift this to this holiday season? We've never done two ice cream makers at $29.95. And I think honestly, that if you, if you took away the details and the graphics and we said, okay, here is an ice cream maker that is $29 and change, everybody would be like, oh, it's a good deal, it's a good price. But to get two of them, obviously you'd have to keep both of them, but you could give one away, that's an amazing buy. We're about to cross the 1250 mark. We have how many minutes? About seven minutes left. Chef, I'm gonna try this one. To Get be into creative yeah. and inventive is amazing. It's really, when you make ice cream at home, it is about creativity and it's about being interactive. Again, bring the kids and the grandkids around the table, let them make their flavor, let them choose their toppings, right? Isn't that good? So that's the simple vanilla base just with some cocoa powder to make chocolate ice cream. Again, once you master simple ice cream, you can make cinnamon ice cream, you can make cookies and cream ice cream, you can crush in your toppings, drizzle in your sauces as it's churning, make your Rocky Road ice cream and you control the ingredients, the amount of sugar, the amount of fat, lactose, frozen yogurt, sorbet. That sorbet was just straight up strawberry with lime juice and zest, no added sugar. Now over here, I did a mango sorbet. Again, same idea. You don't have to add sugar. I find them naturally sweet enough. And look at this. Now by the way, a mango sorbet is something you can incorporate into a cocktail as well. Mm. So let's say you wanna make mm, a mango and lime sorbet and put it into like a little margarita. You can do that too. So it's also good for, you know, adult parties and kid parties. Everyone loves it. Okay, we're all happy. We're very happy. It's, funny, it's, it's easy to be happy. Ice cream in somebody's hands and everything is right with the world. Yeah. What's wonderful is though, the sorbets, the gelatos, the ice creams, look at the texture, look at the consistency. Beautiful. It's right. Do you know what I mean by that? It's right. You go to the, look, chef, you Beautiful. go to the ice cream shop, what would you spend? It's 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 money. If it's a family of four going, hundred percent. It's a lot of money. Let's face it. And it's all gotten more and more expensive. And also, it's not an interactive experience. No. When you go out and buy ice cream, the the level of interactivity is everyone goes to the glass, they press their nose up against it, and they pick, and you're done. To do an actual activity where your kids and your grandkids can actually gather around, create their own flavors, name their own flavors. Control your amount of sugar, control your amount of lactose, or fat, or cream, or frozen yogurts. Go for it, Adam, it's okay. Sorry, I can't Come stop. On. I can't stop. You're in control, and it's just one of those interactive things that you can share with your kids and your grandkids, and my kids love it. Well, obviously, as you can see, I love it as well. And you love it too. No question, it tastes real good. And we're doing this so oh, yeah. quickly and easily. You don't need a ton of ingredients. Don't be fooled by the ingredient label on the back of the ice cream that you buy. Oh, chef. Little pistachio. Okay, pistachio is my favorite flavor. I got a little bit of my, my sorbet on it, but that's okay. It could be a good new flavor common. Actually, it kind of looks cool. It does look it cool. I meant to do that. <laughs> of Adam, course you did. Obviously, I meant to do it. And this is what I'm saying. Talk about interactive. Now I've got a new flavor, ladies and gentlemen. We're going to call it strawberry pistachio <laughs> a la Chef Shahir. 
It's going to be a These new These are thing the moments. All over the world. It's a eureka <laughs> moment right here. Um, if you'd like to try this out, we'll send it right to your door. Chef has been here since midnight. We are wrapping up our big Kitchen HQ day. The team saved this for us for obvious yep. reasons. It's a wonderful feel-good item that is a two for it's the gonna be price good. of one, two, kind of four. I mean, it really is. Nice. Mm. It's good. It was a happy accident. There I it like is. It. We like happy I accidents. Like um, again, mm. being creative, maybe you've got a celebration or a kid's birthday party coming up. You get the caramel sauce, sauce the that. chocolate sauce, the M&Ms. You make, everybody does their own ice creams. Everyone does their own ice creams. And again, I did this for my six-year-old's birthday party. These kids loved it. They drizzle in their own toppings. You kind of set up a candy bar. I like mm. to go to the bulk food store, get a bunch of toppings, nuts, candies, whatever, different sauces. And as it turns, kids, guests can kind of drizzle in their own flavor Add combination. Add in different stuff. And they name their flavor, and they take pride in it. And it's like an activity. It's really fun. Okay, so real fast, black and white. Angelisa, mm. said black and white's about to go. Mm. Okay, black and white's about to go. There's also, I'm not that, it, honestly, I mean, I, at this price. Well, actually, sorry, I should have said this. I'm too occupied with the ice cream. But no matter <laughs> which color you choose, everybody gets a white. Right, so everybody's yep. getting a white, and then you're just simply choosing teal, black, or red. There's not a bad color in the bunch, obviously. Black and white, the final 150 to go around. This is the white teal, and then, of course, the white with the red, which is that designer color. The fact that it's small is yep. a big deal to me because it doesn't take up too much space, and it's not another big, chunky thing to store. And, and again, every ice cream maker, Adam, works the exact same way. Every single ice cream maker works that you have to have it in your freezer to become rock-hard frozen, and then the ice cream base churns in that frozen bowl. So I like this size because this is the right size for me personally, but real estate in my freezer is valuable. That's a great size to leave in my freezer all the time. Yeah. So at any time I want ice cream, frozen yogurt, gelato, if my kids are, are, are calling for a craving, we can do it. Larger sizes that can be this big, they gotta live in your freezer all the time. Right, right. And for me and my lifestyle, if you've got kids, if you're busy, I don't know if you want that. So I like that you get this size, and I love the fact that you get two. It's also worth mentioning, they come in a great box, and something we call bow and go. The box is so nice, you could put a bow on one, gift it, and leave one for yourself. So I think that's great too. It's an amazing opportunity to save a ton of money and get something that will be so well received. Chef, here's what's happening, if this is okay with you. Sure. I have to run to the next studio. You got it. To get set for this big anniversary celebration. And it sounds like it's gonna be fun. Oh, it's gonna be so much fun. My friend, you are an amazing talent. Good to see you. Talent. Oh my goodness. I appreciate Thank you. Thank you, sir. Thank you, Adam. Chef, will you take everybody through it one last I'm time? I'm gonna take everyone through it one last time because I really want them to have ice cream parties at home. Go have your celebration. Good to see you. Stand phone if you want to get yours. Don't forget today's special nearly gone as well. Chef, take us through your ice cream. Okay, bar. we're talking ice cream 101. And again, from the beginning, ice cream base is super easy. Vanilla, cream, a little bit of sugar. You've got ice cream. Read the back of your label of ice cream that you store bought. It's a disaster back there. Full of preservatives, extra sugar that you don't need, carcinogens, all that stuff. So you can make ice cream at home, and making it at home beyond the fun is about controlling the amount of sugar, the amount of fat. You can go half cream, half milk. That's a gelato. You can make frozen yogurt. You could do sorbets. These beautiful sorbets that I made had no extra sugar. So take your frozen fruit, your favorite frozen fruit, puree it up, add a little lime juice and lime zest, and boom, churn it in your little ice cream maker. You're gonna have the most amazing sorbet, not just for kids, like I said. Take some of that mango sorbet and put it in a cocktail. Delicious. But the fact that you get two is wonderful. And let's talk again about the size. For me, this is the right size to pop into your freezer. Because like I said, it's gotta be in your freezer for at least 24 hours. And if you're a busy person, you don't wanna have all that real estate taken up. This you can have. So keep one for yourself, gift one, or keep them both. I think they're great. And they come in a great box. Like I said, bow and go. Put a bow on one, gift one, and keep one for yourself. Or do the mental math that I did. If you have a birthday party up for a young child or a grandchild, this is wonderful. If you get four lined up and get the kids involved, get them drizzling in their own toppings and sauces, tell them to get inspired and name their own flavor, let them have a happy accident like I did. Like I accidentally combined sorbet and pistachio ice cream and it kind of tasted good. Can you imagine the fun that kids have doing this? And it's those memories that they're gonna remember as opposed to just kind of taking them to the ice cream shop and buying it for them. Let them get creative. If you never made ice cream before, I put up a ton of recipes on hsn.com. You can do it. And really simple vanilla ice cream, the best vanilla ice cream is three ingredients, cream, sugar, and vanilla. So from there, have a blast. 
you, Chef, so much. An amazing, amazing job. Uh, thank you for all the advice and the guidance and the inspiration with Kitchen HQ. Stay right there for yours. We're going to continue on. The party is here. It's about to begin. Ladies and gentlemen, let's go to the 20th anniversary celebration of the incomparable Miss Heidi Das. You know, there, there's so much meaning behind many of our pieces. I've gotten wonderful letters and phone calls about girls that have treated themselves to butterflies uh, that have been in the collection because they felt like they were going through a metamorphosis and it gave them strength. They felt beautiful when they were wearing it. To know that we are making this beautiful jewelry, it really means something to these wonderful people and uh, that humbles me.